Crafty Crafters, I wanted to bring you along to share you with you all the things that kind of is going on with me right now. The stamping, the journaling, the junk journals, the jewelry making, the bead chunky chains, the books that I'm doing. And this is a tiny, tiny little tour of my craft area on the craft table, as you can see, and a sharing bookshelf with my cats with all my uh, crafting supplies stored one side and the other and also I have over here is my messy table my messy desk yes it's a mess over there is another one of my shelves with some more supplies that I have I'm pointing toward the paper which is regular printer paper and more um, supplies magazine holders to keep some of my stuff organized doesn't look nice I know but I keep some items there I don't want to see but I want to put away some vinyl that I have up there and I also have a cinch machine and some of the supplies for the cinch machine which is the coil and more supplies up there sorry about the light my um cricket I have my cricket right here so I can pull it forward and I can put in the 12 by 24 mat and they can be easily moved around these drawers contain some of the tools that I have for the cricket or some tools that I might need to have some are a little bit safer than others some are pretty dangerous uh, blades that are opened and stuff and then I have some kind of normal ones are tools that help me in the back there you'll see that I have a tool there for little snaps little plastic ones I have some scissors and some tools that can help me when I am doing some of the crafts and excuse the floor it is a disaster it is a kind of a craft area on this side over here I have an extra little table that I use to contain some of the mess or expand depending on how you look at it here I have the uh, stamps that I have kind of been collecting and I also have more stamps on the table and paper and a mess and napkins and oh boy do I have a mess I know I pretty much need a craft room but for now this is my area that is my area and as you can see the floor is part of the area for now and over here these are my stamps some travel stamps that I have gotten from a thrift store uh, 25 cents the manager brought it down I think they were two dollars but she brought it down and that's the travel discover one this one here is the steampunk I'm not too sure if I have a big use for that I might just um, use it as a giveaway if anybody you know uses these things but I bought it thinking I was able to use it or was going to use it and then I didn't really put it to the test. This one is one of those stamps, um, I guess it's like one of those uh, ledger paper that you can use it with. Over here I have a big block stamp for summer, all the fun stuff and it's backwards, that's always fun more stamps these are teeny weeny ones more little square ones and different little themes i have a couple of like um to do's here and there this one pretty neat idea the uh, cd case is holding the stamps um, i wouldn't have thought of that but that's pretty neat i think i'm going to contain some of those and actually put some more stamps in there but those are for summer and then we have some sweets on the right cupcakes and stuff like that sorry i'm going so fast these are your clear stamps and it's 10 cents um from another thrift store i believe or maybe it was the same thrift store from the other one also have these these are christmas themed and i love them they're for snowflakes and a little wind that comes by with your snowflakes and just brushes them off so those are going to come in handy with some of the crafts that I'll be doing soon. Seasons greetings, a uh, little ornament there, maybe a gift card. This one here is pretty hefty. It's a big block. It's brand new. Haven't even stuck the rubber to the wood. It's a recipe kit. So the big one stamps the recipe card and then on the empty spot that you see on the recipe card, hopefully it wasn't too fast, 
that's where you put the small one right there on the right those little small ones so that you'll know what the recipe is for your desserts main dishes your breads your other and your appetizers that's pretty fun and this is right now where I'm keeping my rubber my stamps my clear stamps um, and page protectors in a folder somewhat kind of divided those are the from the may may club may may made it club stamp club uh, that I got into and my favorite stamps that I have been holding that one is for your budget uh, agenda and I haven't really used it to be honest I love them I like the look of them but I haven't put them yet to the actual use might be using more of that soon I'm not too sure these are more of the floral ones, the little older ones that I had gotten. Uh, these are the Christmas ones. On the right is more travel. I mean, on the left is more travel. The right is the Christmas ones for cards or anything. Sorry about the crunching. That is my kitty cat on the side. But I am skimming through the book and just showing you what I've been collecting so far. Like I said, they're not really organized. They're just in there. That's a double that I'm planning to use as a giveaway in a kit for Christmas. Um, it'll be going out in November for a special subscriber. And that will be announced later throughout the, the months. We're out of out now near August. So maybe in October I will be announcing the subscriber who will be um, winning a kit for uh, for Christmas making stuff and that'll be announced later I'll let everybody know so let everybody you know know to subscribe if you're a subscriber you are automatically entered into that uh, drawing and the package is a surprise it's going to have the theme of Christmas come to me and uh, a lot of fun stuff will be going in there things that I love and I would love to share with someone else subscribe and click on that little bell to be notified when I have new ones that I'll be uploading more often now that I have a little schedule going on this box contains many of my inks for different types of uh, stamps uh, and then some of the special inks that I use for distressing the edges. This stamp I bought at I believe um, Tuesday morning and I loved it only because of the words on the side but I will give more in depth later if you guys like comment down below and let me know if you'd like to see more in depth of a specific thing. I'm working on charms for purses and others, junk journals, koozies and a couple of other um, books with the sitch. Thank you for staying with me. I will be back soon. Nice talking to you guys. Hope to talk to you guys soon. Bye for now.